Tell me this. So clearly, it's a it's been a good year for content. It's been a good year for women. It's also been a very very good year for women because of Me Too, right? Uh, yeah. Something that honestly I didn't see coming that quickly yeah. to to the Hindi film industry at all. Um, and it, there's many wonderful things that have come out of the trauma and and the sort of everyone's still very raw. Uh, but but there are many good things coming. Uh, you know, for one for the film producers guild to make it mandatory that all members need to follow posh guidelines and have an icc but what has changed on the ground um has the way of doing business changed has anything on sets changed what has happened of course yeah entirely Awareness. it's also um a feeling of I, to me personally i can speak for myself it took me like a few days for me to just go within and feel that I knew some of this. Right. Why didn't I? I think we all did. You know, I, think, I know this about yeah. this, and I know that, and I'm not acted on it, and that, and I have no right then, you know, uh, to take to, the higher moral yeah, ground. To like, yeah. You know, to I, I, we're all flawed in that. I think we're all accountable and responsible because all of us know things that we constantly will work with people who probably have had history in in this zone. It's to me appalling. I mean, you know, to me, like when I read some of those stories, it broke my heart into pieces, literally, because I felt like this was happening in our environment. And some of it, like we just brush under the carpet by saying it's not my problem. But it is our problem because we are a tiny fraternity. We have to be responsible and accountable to each other. And now today when I see this kind of, you know, like what, what Sid is like as a guild and when posh committees are being set up and it's become a thing, I can see the difference in my own office which really? actually yes. had a very healthy yeah. atmosphere. Yeah. We, 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 all, we have a very kind of, you know, like cool energy like that. You know, it's all good. Like we don't have these kind of predators. Like we, I wouldn't because I think somewhere I'm not that person who would endorse it or endorse it. No, that would be the wrong word. Who would even in Encourage it slightly or allow yeah, it at all. Right. But I can just tell that there is there is all the respect that should have been is there. But now there is a sense of like just just behavior. How do we create an environment where you feel comfortable that you can go and talk to this person and you won't be, you know, a troublemaker? Right. This which is, is what I think Posh is. Posh which is what we've yeah. 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 That is what Posh yeah. Is. no, what we've done in the guild is actually, and that's a committee that Preeti is in and actually Apurva is in as well is that what we've tried to do is, number one, make it mandatory for all our members to have an internal complaints yeah. committee that's yes. headed by a woman. Yeah. Yeah. That woman does, I mean, will most probably not be the CEO of the company because we have very few who of are, course. but be the senior most woman within the organization or someone with the ability to have control over you know, a group of people. And they have to reach out, they can reach out to that person directly without fear of their name being revealed yeah. and ensure that they're able to take their complaint to them. And yes, like like Ria said, we ours are not structured working environments, right? Correct. We've got Correct. sets. But now, got, now they are getting. I mean, if yeah. you're in a bar and discussing a script, you're at a workplace. No, and that's a need, workplace. Yeah. And you right? need someone on ground. Yeah. You need yeah. someone who's physically there yeah. because yeah. when you go through it, when you go through it in that moment, you're not thinking, hmm, I better write this committee email. You Correct. know what I mean? No, and the problem has been that the informality of the working environment yes, has led to people absolutely. feeling like, How am I, you okay? because should I really be taking months. this badly? Because yeah. actually we were no, at and, a bar and, and, I, and, and it was just a comment. What bothers Correct. me yeah. is when you second guess uh, a woman's, uh, you know, a woman's story. Yeah. And by saying that, you know, that, that bothers me the most. Like that really bothers me. And as a man, it really, it affects me when people say that, oh, but there's no proof. Like, you cannot. A woman who'd come out and speak, you right. have to believe her. Yeah. Yeah. But because that's why I love this, this law. Speak. No, yeah. I love this law. It takes for granted if a woman has come up and said something, she's telling the truth. Yes. Right. Yes. It and doesn't, there is no room for mm. question on and that. And there shouldn't be, because shouldn't it takes a be. hell of a lot to put your life out there. No, yeah. and I think it's liberating also to a certain extent for women, because I think that for so many years, and I don't know if Preeti will agree with me, I probably will, but... Uh, you know, you sit in these meetings, sometimes you're the only girl or you're like one of two girls and uh, you know, you'll sit in a meeting and somebody will say something so so incredibly but so vainly sexist, Right. you know, and you're sitting over there and you're like, did you actually say that? Like I've, I had an actor who I pitched a script to, my director told him that, uh, you know, uh, I'll give you the final draft of the script but... Um, uh, you know, Ria wants to go through it and make some changes. So he looked at me and said, so like you're a like producer, producer, like you're actually involved. And I looked at him and said, what the F am I doing here, bro? <laughs> but at the end of the day, I'm saying you'll be sitting in a meeting, someone will say something so sexist and right. you'll just shut up because you'll be like, you know what? I don't want to disrupt go. this. Yeah. It'll happen again. Okay. And nobody will react and you'll be the only one thinking it. And again, you'll shut up. Yeah. And then the third time you start thinking, am I mad? Hmm. Because nobody is reacting. 
no one is reacting and you're so afraid to be that person that's like again she started yeah. you know yeah. like yeah. again she's going on about this feminism thing and then there are three words that many men use that they need to be slapped for for a woman you are Right. Yeah, yeah, for yeah, a woman. Yeah, yeah. For right. a female producer. Uh, right. Yeah. You right. know, like, oh, <laughs> you're, you're not bad, huh? No. <laughs> no, <laughs> female producer, you're rather like, you know, on top of it or right, whatever. Like, right. I mean, yeah, you know, yeah. I mean, it's. I think there's a lot of unlearning that has to happen, huh. you know, and the, the disruption has started, and which is good. Yeah. For yeah. all of us. For all of us. Because, yeah. I think we have to admit that maybe yeah. we three to five years ago, like Karan said. I tell you, everyone's messages are becoming more polite to each other. Everyone's with the point. Everyone's the questioning wink, this The fear. wink emoji has taken a big beating. <laughs> no one is saying. Yeah, how's the case is? <laughs> yeah, no yeah. sweethearts, no. I know. No, no, you know, a lot of men are saying that, oh, so that means we can't even talk to a woman. I mean, we can't even compliment a woman. We can't. Right. The fact fact is that a woman knows it's about the exactly. impact of the woman and you're woman also knows. aware when you're crossing yeah. the line you're aware and, yeah. but i hope the way i really hope that occurring. the collateral yeah. damage is that they do, people don't stop employing women yeah. but i've that heard that thing. girl and, and that is yeah. my we've biggest problem that. we've all yeah. heard it that this is too much trouble let's yeah. not employ but you or think the other gonna, side oh, no, let's not employ an attractive woman no i don't even that know is something that. that someone has actually said to me that nahi wo thoda aati thi apna skirt ke sath and all that stuff i was like bro no, so there she, is she's asking for it you know what i mean and i just feel like oh my god No, but the, these they are know. things that's just there is ingrained. Yeah, yeah. Like you know, sometimes these things. Unfortunately, sometimes when men say things, yeah. I really don't think that they're, they're even thinking. Yeah. They're not they're, aware. They're, they're not. just it's saying just it because it's yeah. part yeah. of their. If yeah. they've just grown up hearing these things yeah. and they yeah. continue yeah. saying them, and they think it's okay because they've gotten away with it. Right. Right.